Hey, it's T-Man. I'm in Mountain Iron, Minnesota. It's kind of like Iron Mountain, but it's backwards. It's a town, a little town, right here. And uh, it's got some interest. There's my bike. Uh, I bike down here, and then I hike back to uh, Virginia. There's the official gateway, and then the, the trail goes off that way down there. To, on that, uh, over here we have some stuff uh, to do with, they've got a nice little park here with mining stuff. And it uh, tells you all about the, the different types of equipment that was used uh, in the mines, all the different, uh, uh, here's a, 994H wheel loader right there. And different, you know, ones from Cat. You got cranes. Oh, this is a drill here. It's a blast hole drill. Wow. Then you got the big, huge 240 ton trucks. And uh, the D11 tracks type trailer, tractor, and there's the blasting. So, uh, they kind of got the timeline on everything works. There's an excavator. It's all fenced in. It says keep off. There's a bucket right there. And here's a big wheel. Look at that. Big wheel from one of those big trucks. Uh, right there. Look at that. Now, as I said, this is their post office over there. There's the bucket and my van there. Just a nice little area here that they got in this town. And it's called, the town's called Mountain Iron. And uh, you might want, wonder what where the uh, mountain is. I'll show you. It's right over here. Here it is. It's now a valley. <laughs> That's the, uh, what's left of the mining pit right there. And it's even got a little waterfall going into it. That's kind of weird. Uh, uh, some more displays up in here. And a little bit more of the, um, the history and the, the geography and all that stuff. Uh, but this actual town of Mountain Iron has like uh, two pits. It's surrounded by gravel pits. And over here they have a locomotive, too, under this little canopy here. That's pretty cool. Nice little picnic area. Nice little uh, tribute area. That's kind of like the main street right there. And what does this say over here? Mountain Iron Mine has been de designated a registered National Historic Landmark. Wow. And again, uh, coming up to the locomotive here. Right there. And it doesn't say that to say off of it, so we're going to go up and give it a yank. The other uh, the excavator over there said to keep off, but this one doesn't. This must be where all the coal used to be, and you'd have to uh, put it in the fire plate right there. Wow, look at all this. And somebody had to take care of the big crank right there. Wow, this is really, really cool. Then you get up here and look down the track this way. That's really cool. Except for there's a house over there and not a track. We'll go down here. Like I said, there's this big crank right here. And that, thing must, that must be the brake. And here's looking down the other side of the locomotive. That's really cool. Well, 
We'll get down from here. Take one last look at it. Here. We got a nice uh, number 806. And some sort of plaque on the front there. Well, there it is. Oops. Again, I'm in Mountain Iron, Minnesota. Right there.